when we had last left the Tarnished. They were continuing their exploration of the Altus Plateau, where they fought another godskin apostle at the top of the Windmill Village Hill or whatever, and also encountered a weird laser dragon. Whoa. There were also catapults launching horrible things all around town. And, of course, who could forget the incredible ruins of... Some gravesite place. It was a big sweeping dungeon. It was really fun. It was really cool. There inside, there were like shadowy figures of enemies seen before that could only be vulnerable by way of some light. Now, however, it was time to explore the inner wall, the first wall of Laindal, the capital city. This is Elden Ring. Welcome back. Let's do it, baby. Let's see. Which direction shall I go first? You know what? Like I said, let's check around this way. Let's check around over here. Just real quick. Just in case there's something up and around on this. There wasn't elsewhere, but you never know. Right? I think there were... Outside there was fucking... What? Those... Beetles. That was about it. Yeah. Looks like a whole lot of nothing here just as well. Okay. Tree! Stay calm. Oh, fuck. Praise the champion. Who's the champion? I don't know. Is this tree, like, not calm? I guess it is kind of not calm. Like, if you go through it, it doesn't really... It's not very calm. Okay. <laughs> Fair enough. All right, so let's check... This southerly section here, this like section that's cordoned off by the roads. You know what, we'll go along the roads first, and then as it branches off right there, you know, as it forks, we'll follow it and see where it leads down this fork, and then we'll check through the wilderness, we'll sort of comb through there a bit. Oh look, there's an encampment over in here. Strong foe ahead. Did it say try cliff Yeah, try cliff Who is the strong foe? Slug ahead. Oh shit. Oh shit. Holy fuck. It just came in here. Okay. I can give this thing the old what for though. Although it just like hurt me big time. It's fine. There we go. Great. Boom. Did you like that? I got in the war cry too. Oh, fuck, is it eating me? Oh shit, it is. Okay. Ooh. Oh my god, my message got appraised. I don't think I would have died, but it did help a lot. <laughs> it's really funny. The timing on that. Okay. Yeah, I don't think I would have died either way, but, uh, it did help. There we go. A golden seed. Man, so they're just coming out of, uh, they're just materializing now. That doesn't seem too good. I don't believe it? <laughs> yeah, me neither. What have you got in here? Doesn't look like anything good. Oh my god, it's something fucking amazing, I think! I think it's something fucking amazing! Oh fuck. Could it be? Colossal weapon. I think this is it! I think this is my baby! I think this is my fucking baby! A hammer made from a boulder used in the war against the giants. One of the heftiest weapons in the entire lands between. After the giants were quelled, and man turned against man in violence, this weapon was all but forgotten. Man has grown feeble in comparison to his forebears. 
Oh, interesting. Huh. Like the ancestors, right? Because they were fucking built. Hmm. Okay. Oh shit, what are the requirements on it? I meet them. 60 strength. Damn, dude. Okay, holy shit, we need to upgrade this shit ASAP. Oh my god. Fuck. Where can I get more good shit to upgrade with? <laughs> right? Because I don't think, like, by default, it's not going to be better than my current thing. Right? Yeah. Man, look, the guard boot, it's like decent for guarding. Holy shit, it's heavy as hell. 26 units. Oh my god. It's like the heaviest thing we would have. <laughs> Holy shit, okay. Um, oh, I should unequip that before I forget. There we go. Uh, what What else should I put here? Uh, I guess our, yeah, our, rave, our claw talisman. Okay. Well, fuck. Holy shit. What an incredible thing. We may have to downgrade our fucking armor until we can get even more endurance. <laughs> okay. Hell yeah, look. This endurance thing, it's been panning out. If anything, maybe we should have started on this endurance train long, further longer ago. Okay. Oh, what is all that? Is that Caleb down there? It is, wow. Huh, it looks so unimpressive from up here. Let's see, anything else? There's the Raya Lucaria Tower that we can't get into. As far as I know. I mean, I guess we could try it again, see if we pick something up. I'm pretty sure we didn't. Man, I can't believe... Remember, we'd been seeing it on, like, NPCs and uh, specters of other players for a while. It was just right up in here. We could have gotten this thing, like, <laughs> a million years ago. Fuck. Oh, the unfortunate thing is, though, how the fuck do you get a second one? That other person had two. They must have had, like, a friend or whatever drop them one. Which I don't know if I want to go that far, right? Especially not on a first playthrough. And of course, like, if we're on a second playthrough, we'll may as well just come over and pick up another one. You know, if you're on New Game Plus. Okay, well. Oh, you know, we definitely need to make a beeline for this fucking place. Hell yes. We may find exactly what we need there for this new hammer. Oh, could you imagine if it used... Well, there's no fucking way. I was about to say, if it used somber smithing stones to upgrade... That would be awesome, but I really do not think that's the case. Because it did not say it was like a legendary weapon we didn't get from like a boss or anything. It's just out here. That said, my go-to weapon right here, this like concrete hammer thing, it was just a weapon that was out there. Oh fuck. These wolves mean fucking business. Okay, we'll take all this. Good. Holy grease. Oh, shit. I guess it makes sense that we'd find it here of all places. Solidified grease made from a mixture of holy resonant materials. Coats armament, adding holy damage to attacks to last only a short time. Okay. Nothing special. Jeez, what happens if you, uh... <laughs> if you cook with that? <laughs> You know? I feel like there need to be some people in this world who are, like, trying to cook with all this weird grease that's going on, you know? Oh, shit. Oh, this water is really low. Oh. Oh, the fucking map is not what I thought was going on at all. Huh. I wonder if this is higher up, then. Because it looks significantly different compared to this. Oh, so our little, our, like, what do you call it? It's probably, ooh, fuck yeah. It's probably, um, fucking down there, our cave, our mining shaft or whatever. 
Oh shit. There are jars. Okay. Smack this fool. Oh fuck. There we go. Oh wow, we actually got a sword spear off of that one. Slurping. Okay. What horrible thing awaits here? Oh look, this herd tree is kind of big. Yeah, it's a growing minor herd tree. Huh. Missionary's Cookbook 4. Huh. Craft Holy Grease. Wait, have we read Missionary's Cookbook before? A record of crafting techniques left by a man who, unable to become a finger maiden, instead became a missionary and went forth to spread holy teachings. So Holy Grease, Hallibone Arrow, Hallibone Bolt, or Halligbone. I think the G is silent, though. It seems like a word where the G would be silent. Secret Passage! Oh, fuck yes! Oh, yes, I love that. <laughs> okay. Oh. Oh. Wow, you had, like, your own camouflage and everything. Okay. Oh fuck, a lot of people just dying here. No jumping ahead. First off, suffering, and then likely, sadness. Wow. Man, pe a lot of people trying to jump down there. A shocking amount of people trying to fucking jump that. Oh fuck me. Oh fuck me! Oh! Oh! There you go. Just a flight pignon. Liar head. Weird, so is this about to like become a bigger Erd tree? Like a normal looking minor Erd tree? It sure seems that way. Why the jars though? Hmm. Oh, uh, what if this is the grim duty of the jar people in this world. They are born to die in service of the fucking Erd trees. That's why we've always seen them here. Right? What if that's it? Right, because we know that they get stronger and they put like warriors and stuff inside of them. You know, all of the blood inside, it's from warriors and shit. So what if they go and collect all that shit from around uh, the lands between, bring it to a church or a site where an Erd tree is growing. Yeah, a site where an Erd tree is growing. And they, they come here and they die, right? Or they kill themselves even. That way the, like, juice or whatever inside goes to the Erd tree. Because we know that people do that, right? Like at the roots and everything. Fuck. Try friend, and then let there be gesturing. What does that mean? Okay. Ew, look at this. Why does its bark look so f- Oh look, hey, there's centipedes here. The bark on it looks so fucking weird, dude. Okay. Look, this also looks like a- Yeah, this is also an Erd tree. There's three of them here. Golden Order Seal. Oh, it's like a catalyst or something. Elden Ring. Try Finger's Butthole. You fucker. Oh, Int and Faith. Huh. For incantations, though. Boosts Fundamentalist in incantations. A formless sacred seal depicting the ceremonial observation of order enhances golden order fundamentalist incantations. Fundamentalism is scholarship in all but name. Scales incantations with using both intelligence and faith. Okay. So it's the int and faith version of our claw mark seal. Alright. Sure. Should we rest? I guess. Why not? 
There we go. Let's get out of here. Let's check this little, like, land bridge over to... Yeah, over to this section. Do you think there's a hole in the wall here? Doesn't look like it. There are a few fucking bloodstains. Well, there's one. What in the world were you fighting here? Huh. Maybe they got invaded? Right, they had co-op on and someone invaded them? Okay. Shit. There we go. Easy enough. Guardian garb. Oh. All right. Engraved golden garb worn by the guardians of the minor Erd trees. In accordance with an ancient pact with the Erd tree. Sorry about that. <laughs> it smacks something. It is said that their deaths led not to destruction, but instead to renewed eternal life as guardians. Okay. Smoldering butterfly? Huh. A tarnished sunflower. Really? I thought that there would be like a... A golden one here. No jumping ahead. Okay. Thank you. Be wary of liar. Cliff, oh cliff. Try mushroom, and then visions of something incredible. I see. Okay. Well, let's loop around here and go inside of this place, right? Oh, jeez. Be wary of jumping off, but group ahead. It looks like those little egg dudes. Okay. I'm ready for it. I want some... Some upgrade materials. I got something in need of upgrading. Ooh, we got some birds here too. Alright, down here, lovely, over this way, and yeah, look, it almost looks like there's little seams of gold inside of just the regular rocks the closer we get to the Erd tree. Right? Huh. Okay, over here, is there something on the left too? There is, look there's a jump pad and everything. I don't know if you can get down from here safely, though. Oh, it looks like there's a... You know, there's a passage in between. Okay. Cool. Oh shit, we're at stake. Oh fuck. Grace ahead. Why are we at stake? What the hell's down here? I don't like that. Seek strong foe. I'd love to. I don't know where it's at though. Seek here. What? Oh. Oh, is that the strong foe that they're talking about? Fuck. Like, staggers me and everything. Flinches me. Okay. Oh, hell yeah. Uh, oh, shit, slugs! Ash of War, prayerful strike. It's not powerful. It's prayerful. 
What is up with the presence of slugs and stuff? Ooh, these are like shooting something different out? It's like a, a red. Is it crimson or scarlet rot? Let there be slug. Try brief respite? Fuck no. Skill ahead. Yeah, let's read about our skill. Okay. Jeez, are we under attack? We got like combat music. Sacred affinity, prayerful strike. Raise armament aloft in prayer, then slam it into the ground. This inspired blow restores HP to the self and nearby allies if it successfully hits. Usable on axes and hammers? Huh. Weird. I don't think we found anything that's hammer specifically yet, but we have found one that's axes and hammers. Okay, let's search over here first before I go through this passageway. It's easier for me to like delineate and understand where I've been. Okay, we'll do it one section at a time. Do I really need to kill this thing? No, I don't. I truly do not. Well, fuck, this one looks kind of important. It might drop something. I don't think that's the case. It's kind of like such a little anus there on the bottom, huh? Grab this. Blood Rose. Ooh. What's that doing here? Okay. Cool. Cave ahead. Alright. Let's turn on our light. Wonderful. Alright. We'll grab the grace. Good. I don't need to rest at it. I'm fine. Liar ahead. Attacking required ahead. Yep. Okay. Sealed tunnel. Oh, man. Do you think we should turn on our one of our foul foots for this? Maybe we'll get extra shit? Because don't they drop um, shit that we need? Like, if, I, if I'm in the market for some fucking upgrades, you know, should be getting it from these dudes, huh? Mmm, I eat the toe. <laughs> I'm a freak. Oh, shit. Poison stone. Uh-oh. Maybe this was a mistake. Precious I am, but visions of ambush. I'm jumping down! I'm going to behave irrationally in here. Cracked crystal? Oh, fuck. Maybe we fucked up using this toe. Oh, God. I just want to use the super hammer. Oh, look at this freak down here. I do need to read about Poison Stone. Oh, look, we got a Smithing Stone 5. That's good. Oh, look, it's a, it's a little lad! Something incredible ahead. Hidden path ahead. Oh, Smithing Stone Miner's Ball Bearing 2! <laughs> fuck yes! Fuck yes! Okay, there's also a hidden path behind that, it seems. Right. I'm going to rapidly continue looking around real quick. Uh, 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 are we good? Are we good? Looks like... Oh, shit. There's some shit up there. Fuck me. This is a really poorly spent foot. Foul foot. Golden Ring 5. <sighs> Be gone, sinner! Through here. What have we got? Let's lower the machine. I'm almost positive we'll have a secret route. Yep. There it is. Ba 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 Oh, shit. <laughs> I think I overshot. Oh, no, wait. I think I'm good. I think I'm actually good. Something incredible ahead. Oh, dear lord. 
Oh shit! Oh my god, I almost fucked it up big time. Oh gosh. Okay, down we go. Send it back up. Hidden path ahead. Anything below? No. Oh yeah, rolling still works. Hidden path ahead. Hidden path ahead. Golden Rune 5. Okay. Holy shit, what an area. Holy shit. Okay. Let's continue upward here. Drop down onto this root. Oh, are these roots from the Greater Erd Tree? Is that what this is? Oh, I bet it is. I bet that's exactly what this is. Oh shit, I hear a little lad having a laugh. The laughter of a little lad. It's perverse, sickening laughter. Oh shit, he's little ladding me. Jeez, they got the bee stab on me. Fuck, my, my foot has worn off. Ah, stone sword key. Okay, well. I guess we got one fucking thing out of the foul foot. Oh shit, it's one of those big, like, Iron Maiden machines. Okay, well, let's definitely cross over here first. Oh shit. Good. Be gone! Oh, what's in here? Why is it always cramped area? Why is it cramped? Jeez, you gotta drop down? Be wary of down. Be wary of trap, but here. Fuck it. Man, so these things are in here now. Interesting. Okay. Oh shit, Grace Mimic. Oh right, I need to read about the Poison Stone, don't I? Small sto stoin stone with a poison. <laughs> it's stoison! <laughs> <laughs> With a poison core. Throw at enemies to cause buildup of poison. Miners employ these stones as tools for pest extermination, but have long forgotten how to craft them. I think that's uh, similar to what we'd read before. Large glint stone. Anything else? What do we got up here? We got something up here? Is this something? This is not something. Jeez, look at all the eye, eye clumps. Look, we're on the other end now. Old Fang, two of them. They were a vampire. Okay, hidden path, but trap. Uh oh. Oh no! I wonder if that'll open it. No. Okay. Seems familiar. It does seem kind of familiar. Man, there's that whole other area we didn't explore, though. We need to remember that. Okay. So I want over here. Down this way. Grab that. Here. Oh. <laughs> Why is it always giant tree? <laughs> okay. <laughs> I don't like it. Uh, here I go, I'm charging up my run. Yeah! Ah, well done. Thank you for the four lightning grease. I'll rub it all over my body. Yeah. Oh, shit. <laughs> it's greased lightning! Oh, fuck. It's, yeah, it's gre greased lightning. Okay. Man. 
I really do not like that movie. But, admittedly, the main reason, I guess, is because they just played it so much on broadcast TV. Maybe it's it's actually a good movie and I've just, you know, I've fallen prey to some kind of jaded cynicism just because it, it played all the fucking time growing up. Explosion! Calmness. Okay. Man, we've been at stakes for a while without... Wait, what? Is that the boss arena? Seek weak foe. Hold up. What's over here? No hidden path ahead. It's true. I failed! <laughs> okay, yeah, this looks like a boss room. Be wary of grace, but be wary of weak foe. Behold, weak foe. Onyx Lord. Oh, uh, right, we fought one of you in the Everjail. See, doesn't this look like fucking, um... Gold Mask, the, the Golden Headed? Wow, I don't know how you missed me with that, but, uh, eat a butt. <laughs> Onyx Lord's Great Sword. Wow. Okay. Let's read all about it. Great sword forged from golden-hued meteoric ore. Oh. The blade conceals gravity-manipulating magic. A weapon unique to the Onyx Lords. A race of ancients with skin of stone who were said to have risen to life when a meteor struck long ago. Oh, weird. So it's like a War of the Worlds situation. Right? Wasn't that like... Or no. Am I thinking of the right movie? Maybe I'm thinking of the Tom Cruise one. <laughs> right? Wasn't there... There was... Wasn't that the Tom Cruise World, War of the Worlds that they were already on the planet or something? And I forgot what happened, but something activated them and they came up out of the ground. Some shit like that. Like, they were here all along. Unique skill, Onyx Lord's Repulsion. Thrust the armament into the ground to create a gravity well. In addition to dealing damage, this attack sends enemies flying. Does magic damage too. Has some in scaling. Okay. Didn't expect weak foe. Well done. Thank you. Look at all these statues here. Are they making them? Is this where they make them? It fucking looks like it, doesn't it? Like, they're making them here ready to ship them out. Huh. Behold. Well done. What the fuck is this? Oh, shit! It's the Divine fucking Tower, baby! There is a little path down here. Wow! Okay. Hmm. How about that? What does this one do? Oh, smithing stone three and four. Hell yes. Oh yes. Oh yes. Oh yes. Behold. Bright spot. Can we see the root of it? Not really. Huh. Hmm. I wonder if there's an underground area underneath the prime erd tree or whatever whatever it's fucking called <laughs> the prime erd tree look it's it's gold and white right if you were playing warframe you would have to shell out some extra money or grind for a really long ass time to unlock it it's a prime erd tree <laughs> okay oh yeah don't try jumping here it looks like it but uh visions of bloodstain in short try jumping off Seek necessary item. You're a motherfucker. Look at everyone just jumping. Edge? Okay. Divine Tower of West Altus. Seek snake. 
You don't have the right. You don't have the right. I don't have the right. You don't have the right. You don't have the right. You don't, you don't have the right. You don't, you don't have the right. You don't have the right. Okay. I don't have it. Can I actually mount here? Nah. This is just a little interstitial area for travel. For looking cool and feeling fine. Sealed tunnel. Man, so this one was guarded by an onyx lord. Hmm. 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 <laughs> what was the name of the Onion Knights? I don't remember any of their names, but they were very charming every time. Okay. I think everyone's favorite who always went, hmm. Wasn't it like Siegfried or Sigmund? It was something like that. It was Sig something. It was like a very... I think, isn't that like a Germanic name? Alright. Let's take care of you. My rocks! No, all the poison rocks I've been hauling around. Why would you do this to me, Tarnished? My pet rocks! Ah. I do it because I'm a fucking monster. I'm a fucking monster! Okay. Let's go down here. I want to check out that other area. Oh shit. Our light is gone. Need it back. Yep. Rolling on to buttons. I push button, that's all I need to do. It's my greatest skill. The ability to push button. Uh-oh. Look at this. Ooh, they put a few roots in this one. Uh-oh. Oh, man. <laughs> What's his name? Hidetaki is getting a little... What's his name? Am I mistaken? I'm not even gonna... I'm not even gonna say because I don't know his name by, by heart. It's Miyazaki, right? It's Miyazaki, right? I, I'm pretty sure. Hidetaki Miyazaki or something like that? I'm pretty sure it's at least Miyazaki. The, like, lead director. Which, obviously, you know, of course, video games are made not just by one, like, auteur, but by entire teams of people working together. It's a collaborative effort. Okay. Going over here. But whoever... The team at FromSoft. They want to spice things up a little bit this time. Yo, what if we used one of our modular dungeon things? And we just got a little fucking sexy with it. We start putting roots everywhere, baby. Oh shit, this one is clad of gold? Runark. Man, didn't we see someone wielding one of these pizza cutter weapons? How have we not gotten that yet? We saw it like a long time ago too, didn't we? Maybe we'll get it right here. Maybe this is it. Eh, wishful thinking. Oh no! Oh, you motherfucker! Oh no! That's what we needed! Fuck! Okay. I didn't even see that thing over there. Fuck me. Oh, shit, shit, shit. We needed to get it to go ramming speed. Oh, no. You're breaking my balls. All right. Let's go back this way. Oh, fuck. I just went to the wrong one. This is not what we wanted. It's actually right here. Man, we're like right under it, though. I guess that makes sense if we got to the Divine Tower, right? It's gotta have a lot of horizontal movement going on. Okay. Good. Let's travel back through. Hopefully it respawns, right? I think those tend to. We haven't seen any that don't respawn. At the very least. Alright. Through here. Leave me be, little lad! Leave me be! All right. Oh, shit. You know what? I can take the, the fast way down. 
probably not faster than actually just, you know, doing it, but hey. Oh, I don't know if I can get down from that. I <laughs> just quickly jump back onto it. It's like, wait a minute, that might be death. Being on that side of the big root. Okay. Good. I'm gonna send it back up in case I fuck it up again. I mean, what are the chances be? Because I have to kill it to fuck it up. Okay. Good. Oh shit. Okay. The thing there's smoke bombs don't hurt when they hit you, if they hit you. Boom. Oh, fuck. Okay. Come and get some, you filthy fucker. Yeah, yeah. Do your thing. Oh, not that. Do your other thing. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. No, fuck. Am I going to die? <laughs> oh, shit me. Oh, is this it for me? Oh, I, I live still. Uh, uh, uh. Smithing stone six, three of them. It was not worth it. Jeez, dude. Nope, not this time. There we go. Jeez. All right, we should be able to fast travel out of here now, right? Yeah. Oh, goodness gracious. Okay. Let's see. Oh, you know what? What the fuck? Was that a little lad? I think it is. Okay, they're not down here with me, though. Alright, let's go back to round table. Let's turn in some of our shit here, right? Nothing weird and new has happened, right? You don't have anything to say? Okay, we're good. How about you, you poor bastard? Oh no, you have died, finally. Roger's bell bearing. Ugh, sorry, bud. Oh, you left a letter, too. Good God. Letter written in a trembling hand. I forgot to tell you, but it seems D has a younger brother. I heard he lies in a deep sleep in the aqueduct beside the eternal city of Nocron. It's said, and it's said he stood before the Prince of Death not far beyond that spot. Huh. The aqueduct? Rashir, I don't know what the fuck this means. <laughs> Rajer, the sorcerer's bell bearing, found upon his perished flesh. Offer to the twin maiden husks at the round table hold to gain access to new items. Oh, look, it's got a little bit of blood on it. Hey. How about your outfit? Fuck, you got a big hat, though, dude. You got a big hat. Oh, I like that. Oh, I like that big hat. Mmm. Glintstone Sorcerer Rogier's pointed hat, a sign of a heretical practitioner, strengthens Glintstone's sorcery skills. Rogier spent his entire life behaving with utter detachment. No one noticed the anger, grief, regret, or fear that existed along with it. Oh my god! Okay. Glintstone's sorcerer Rogier's traveling attire graced with an intricate aristocratic decoration. 
strengthens glintstone sorcery and skills. Looks like some fucking Witcher 3 equipment. Okay, all same. How's the hat look, though? That's sad, but how's the hat look? How's the hat look? Oh, hell yes. Oh, I love the hat, but unfortunately... My shit clips through it! Oh, what a nightmare! Oh, I hate it. I hate that my shit clips through. That is no good, dude. That is no good. Amazing hat, though. Amazing hat. Yeah. As cool as it is, I cannot abide by that ever-present clipping like that. If it were something less obvious, perhaps. But no. It's gotta go. There we are. Oh, whoops. Okay. That'll do. Good. Well, let's go get our new bearings over to the grandmas. Anyone else over here? Anyone do anything weird? Gideon. Journey to the capital. The two fingers will deny you. you may be our bet. So you do want me to go to the capital. Forgot about that. Hmm. Okay. So maybe we won't go into the capital itself then? Bell bearing shop one. Is this all of Roger's stuff? Oh, I see. It is. Huh. Purchase. Oh, look at all that. Mm-mm-mm. Okay. Very well. Should I buy a memory stone now? Because I want to upgrade this other fucking weapon. We'll see how this pans out. Okay, over here. Oh, but the thing is, with this other weapon, if I want to dual wield, I need another colossal weapon, don't I? Otherwise, it's not going to have a proper dual wield attack. Do I have another colossal weapon? I know I've got lots of colossal swords. But just Colossal Weapon. Colossal Sword. Great Hammer. Colossal Weapon. <gasps> and I can wield it. The Watchdog Staff. Hmm. And amazingly, it's Strength and Dex. I would not have anticipated that. Colossal Sword. Sword. Jeez, there's a lot of colossal swords. How is the fucking anchor not a colossal weapon? What are we doing? Huh? What are we doing? Oh, colossal weapon, golem's halberd. I can't equip this. Hmm. But I don't think it's better than the watchdog thing. Right? 165 plus 68. D&D. &D. 165 plus 168. Er, 165 plus 68. 165 plus 68. Oh. 158 plus 77. Huh. 21 units, 19. This one has a unique skill, though. Which I probably would not want. Channel magic into the glintstone to activate an ancient sorcery, producing floating magic projectiles that chase enemies automatically. I don't know that I want that. Hmm. Oh, that's the end. Okay. 
Very interesting. 155 plus 97 already, because it's already got string scaling of C. That's wild. Okay. Or can I get a colossal weapon over here? From one of the remembrances? Oh, like Radon's. Well, Radon's weapon is probably a colossal sword. When you think. Let's see. Over here. Hey. Okay. That is a great axe. Staff. Colossal sword. Bummer. Okay. Alright. Well, at least we have some choices. Right? Fair enough. Alright. Well, let's hit this dude up real quick. Well, I took you for dead. No matter, it's all out. You're up. Okay. So let's strengthen our shit. There we go. So if I can get this to 17, I don't think I can. Or 16. We'll be good. Oh, shit. Oh, wait, I could do it? Am I missing... Oh, no, I am missing smithing stones. Okay. Oh, but can't I get smithing stone five? Can't I get that? Can't I buy that from the, the old ladies? Hold up. Let's see over here. No, smithing stone four. Fuck. Shit. Okay. So we do need more. Hmm. Well, on the bright side, I've got shit to pour resources into now. Right? Okay. Well, let's haul ass back out of here. Over to... Hmm. Do you think it's better to go right here and then go back down? Rather than start from here and then try to ascend? Actually, it'd be better right here, wouldn't it? Yeah. That's ideal. Okay. There we are. Okay, so we definitely want to go back down here because there was something on the northern end of all this. Jeez, upgrading your weapons and stuff kind of takes a lot of juice out of you. It's got to be said. Takes a lot of runes. I wonder where the other smithing stone thingamajigs are too. The bearings. They're quite good to have. Okay, over here. Slugs, right? Evade them. Alright. Oh, it's just a jump pad. Is there actually anything else here? Hidden around or whatever? No, doesn't seem like it. Let's turn on our light. Yeah, it extremely does not seem to be the case. Okay. Up and at him. Oh. Shit! Oh my god! Holy fuck! I almost thought we were about to go into the full fucking city. Sheesh. Okay. How weird we can summon here. <laughs> I was partially expecting a dragon to appear. I'll admit. Okay. Likely bug. Hmm. 
Anything up this way? No. We're beyond the point of summoning, though. It's just right here? How odd. How peculiar. Huh. Okay. Oh, shit. Oh, it's one of you. Oh, shit. Oh, my gosh. Fucking Darth Maul maneuvers here. You're way easier than the other one, though. Yeah, you're not even a boss. Do you even do magic? Are you even a fucking magician? I don't think so. <laughs> there you go. Gargoyle's Great Axe. Hey, what if it's a colossal fucking weapon? Huh? Huh? Ah, oh, it's a Great Axe. Okay, that, uh... That makes a lot of sense. <laughs> Bronze Great Axe wielded by Valiant Gargoyle. Just like the wielder, the missing parts have been mended with corpse wax. A patchwork of champions. Ugh. Oh, what if the wax is like tree wax, like a sap, like pine tar or something? Listen, I've played Stardew Valley. I know you can get some cool shit out of trees and whatnot. You put like a little bucket around it. <laughs> Maybe that's what they get out of the Erd trees, like the minor Erd trees. Corpse wax. It comes out. Oh. That would make a lot of sense. Especially since we know what goes into the trees. Do you think that's required for the trees to live? Like a, a human sacrifice or just a, like a sacrifice of life of any kind? Maybe. Okay. Let's head on over here. Good. Oh, look at this. Very boiled egg yolk looking sky. Kind of like a nasty gold. Holy shit, what is all this? What are all these things? Are these really big arrows? Like, we've seen some big arrows in our time. Are these, like, really, really big ones? Anything else over here? Doesn't seem like it. No, I don't think so. Okay. Oh. It's a crone. Take your seeds, though. Whoa. Oh, I almost thought there were three of them. First off, precious item. Didn't expect abundance. All the more praise the seed. Praise the herb tree. Ah, fingers. No head ahead. You, please. You okay, there you go. A tarnished would one day become Elden Lord and restore the Golden Order. Surely you see it too. The gold that enshrouds the heavens. The great tree, which begets the pillars of light. Oh, tarnished. Hasten to the foot of the tree. And whatever you might face, the fingers will surely guide you. Hmm. Okay. The door does look shut. Oh, look, there's a beetle over there. I'm gonna try and get that beetle. Yeah, I bet we can't get inside without having something cool. Oh, fuck. Damn, that one went away real fast. 
Did it reappear somewhere else, like before? I don't think so. Huh. Maybe it's one of those ones that you have to shoot. Be wary of left. Yeah, true enough. What's up here? Is this a boss? No, these are just people. Getting killed. Ooh, sorry, everybody. Just trying to get in through uh, the doors. I'm the ill omened creature. These are just like commoners trying to get in. Be wary of castle. What's this gonna say? You don't have the right? Yep, yeah, okay. Ashes of war? Okay. Yeah, part of me was wondering how it would handle that if you went in through there. When it looks like it's just fucking water. Hmm. I wonder if part of the city, like, got eradicated or sunk or something? Oh, hey, look. Dude over there. Okay. Well. Let's see. Can I do some crafting real quick? Let's make some freaking... Oh, look. The crystal darts are actually made from cracked crystal. Ah. Huh. You know what? Maybe I'll make some of these. I've already got 40. Maybe I'll make some of these. Well, I've already got 40. Really? Yeah. Okay. Well, sure. All right. Let's see. Is there a side of grace over here to, like, the north? I don't see anything like that at all. Because I would kind of like to rest and get that beetle back before I forget that it exists there. You know? Let's do it. Let's go down here. Let's rest and have the beetle return. Okay. Let's equip over here. Good. I just realized that these weapons have scaling on them. Huh. Interesting. Okay. Sure. Yeah, the bone dagger had B strength scaling and A dex scaling and all that. I guess that makes sense, so they do more damage as you play. That's clever. Okay. Let's rest here. Because that beetle did look like one that would give us an Ash of War. And so I would really like it. Oh, wait. Can we get another flask? I don't know how many things we've got, but... Add charges. Wow, yeah, we could. Okay. Great. Wow, we're up to 12. Holy shit. We got so many. How many do you end up with at the end of this? 20? That seems outrageous. No, there's no way. Okay. Let's head on up here. And that horrible thing should not respawn. Yep, we're good. There's our beetle. Let's select our tool. Okay. Fuck. Fuck. Fuck! Oh, no! Is it gone forever? Jesus. Seek high spot and then jump attack. Really? 
Can it be? Is it possible? Oh shit, it fucking is, isn't it? Yeah, so you would go up here. And then, yep. Try jump attack. Holy shit, that's how you do it. Ooh, what's this combat music for? Alright, fuck it. We're going to get it back again. Oh, you know what? Instead of trying- Oh, fuck. It's because we're in combat with this dude. I think. Shit, I was gonna say we'll just fast travel over. But we're still in combat with something. And we'll save half the trip. I have no idea what we were in combat with. It was just some fucking old codger, I guess. There we go. Save us some time. Okay. Very clever, though. I thought I saw something weird over on the path, but it was just goats. Or yaks, or rams, or whatever the fuck they are. I guess they're rams, right? Isn't that what that thing said? It was a ram. Yeah, these are all rams? Or maybe some of them are rams. Yeah, I don't know. Okay, now we must sneak around so as to not draw its ire and give away our position. And the other half of the city got fucking obliterated. Look at that. All the, like, destruction from the arrows. Look, it even burned up the trees and shit. What was coming from that direction that was so fucking... that warranted such a response? It was some- whatever- whatever it was came from Mount Gelmir, I guess, right? Because that's the main path over there. That's what- what's over there, huh? Okay. So there's our dude. Sneak mode activate. Good. Oh, yes! Ash of War Golden Parry. That's probably not going to be something good for us, but... Good to have collected it, I guess. Sacred Affinity Golden Parry. Perform an Erd Tree incantation and swing the shield to deflect enemy attacks and break their stance. Effective even at a slight distance. Small and medium shields. Okay. Hmm. See, I, I even have my doubts if this is a way in. I feel like it may be over here, you know? Like we were talking about earlier. This might be the way in. I'm not sure. Oh! Oh, oh no, we're fine. <laughs> I thought that was a, a cliff. I was too busy looking at the map. I was, like, thinking of... of like, oh, yeah, look. There's so many different ways you could fall in and fall down. And I thought that was about to fall in and fall down. Okay. So first, I think we check everything to the west, over here, along this wall, because I don't think we've looked at any of it. Right, we'll start from up by the, the gateway, I think. Look at all this. Jeez. It's really been, like, it's like fire shit, too, isn't it? I see the what? Small. Whoa! Hey, this is like, uh, Margit! What's going on? Is this Goat Froy again? <laughs> no, this would be... Uh... Uh, this would be... Marge... Marge... Jet. <laughs> oh, shit. What? Uh oh. Jeez. What the fuck? Huh. 
Viridian Amber Medallion. Did we not actually kill that guy? When we thought that we killed um, Margit, did we not actually kill them? Because remember, they were talking to us at the end. Like when, um, when we killed them, they were saying some weird shit. And I remember even saying like, what the fuck does this even mean? Right? Was that actually because they weren't dead? Traitor ahead. Huh. Oh, greatly raises maximum stamina, plus one version. Viridian Amber Talisman. I wonder if there's a Crimson Seed Talisman plus whatever. A medallion with Viridian Amber inlaid. Boost max stam. The Erd Tree's old sap becomes amber, treasured as the most precious of jewels in the age of Godfrey, the first Elden Lord. A primordial life energy resides inside. How odd. Huh. There's a side of grace there. Maybe they're unkillable? Maybe we're like killing them every time? Like are they going to keep showing up as like a recurring dude or something? They're like tarnished too, right? <laughs> we kill them and then they, they respawn at the nearest side of grace or some shit. <laughs> The last one that they rested at. Okay, man, look at all this shit over here. It looks fucking... It's fucked up. Okay. Oh, you know what? I remember this. I know what this is from. I remember this, this exact vantage point, I think. Like, right about here? Or something like that? Yeah, there was like a, a, a pre-release cutscene or whatever of, I guess, Landel under attack. That must have been the first defense of Landel. There were like trolls attacking. There were a whole bunch of people in like siege towers, shit like that. Huh. Yeah, and they came from this direction. There was like loads of people. It was some sort of like cutscene cinematic trailer thing. I don't even remember what it was called. But yeah, I totally remember that vantage point. Holy shit. Huh. I mean, that extra knowledge doesn't really do me any favors, but... I guess that's what was being referenced- oh, shit. In that trailer. Oh, you got some health, huh? Still keen on doing that, though. There you go. Uh oh. Oh shit. Good. Ah, item. Behold message. It has been beheldin. Oh, look at all these Count Choculas up here. What are they doing? Huh. Are these arrows? I think they are. Hmm. Interesting. So whoever it was, they, they also were not a fan of the Erd Tree, I guess? Well, I can't remember. In that... In that cinematic, was the Erd Tree there? Or was that in the pre prehistoric time before the Erd Tree? I don't know. Well, I'd have to assume that the city was built here because of the Erd Tree. Right? The city wouldn't exist here otherwise if not for- Oh, shit. If not for the Erd Tree. Right? Oh, fuck. Oh, fuck. Oh, fuck. Stop it. Stop your madness. Okay. Look at Count Choculas, swarming around, cavorting. Mm. Mm. Ow. <laughs> there we go. Hmm. 
Weird. Okay. Let's see. Over this way. Oh. There's a bod right there. I'm not gonna horse jump because I feel like that might overshoot. An old fang. Oh, whoops. Oh, dear. Time for bug! Really? Oh, yeah. Time for bug. <laughs> okay. Ho oh, hoi! Alright, we're fine. It's fine. Rainbow stone. Four of them. Okay. Golden rune four. Rump. It's true. Okay. Is there anything else going on over here with fucking the other secondary Count Chocula? Do I need to worry about this Count Chocula or what? I don't know. Hmm. Oh, here's a question. What if... What if Margit, the fell omen, maybe isn't tarnished? but is one of those who live in death, right? Like, you know, the skeletons and shit that we have to kill again when they're dead. We have to, like, hit them again when they're down. What if they're using a similar, not identical, but a similar sort of energy or power? Maybe that's it. I don't know. I'm just spitballing here. <laughs> I'm, I'm throwing out everything I can. What if Margaret the Fell Omen... It's one of the fucking aliens, huh? <laughs> what if they came from the spaceship city from the sky? Huh? Yeah. What if they are the original progenitor race of everyone here? And why everyone is so weird and fucked up? Because <laughs> originally, in the past, as evidenced by the ancestors in the weird city below... People didn't look like this. Maybe it was Margaret spreading their seed or their blood or something around. I don't know. <laughs> we'll maybe find out. Maybe. Okay. All right. Anything else? Have we fully explored it all? I'm not sure. I don't know if we did all this down here, too. By those trees. Right? I'm not sure if we did that. Let's take a quick look. Actually, I guess it's faster if we just fast travel to that and then take a look further north. Because we have that Site of Grace in the north anyhow. Okay. There we are. Seems like it's just a random field unless some weird creature wants to come flying down and try to ruin my day. It's happened before. Huh. Yeah, I don't... I don't think there's anything else around here. I think we may have found it all. Right? There's some little bits of woodland area. Some incandescent shroomages, or bioluminescent, I guess, is the proper term. Nascent butterfly. A rare enough item, but one that we don't really make use of, admittedly. Because I'm such a fucking bastard. <laughs> okay. Yeah, I guess that's that. Alright, so we've searched everything to the south of here and all that. Alright, so now all that remains within this wall is all shit over here. And I betcha this does not go into the city. Right? I bet the only way into the city is from, like, over here or something. 
because this looks very similar to this point in that it will just run you right into a wall. Oh, here's a question. What if, to defend the city, they destroyed half of it and flooded it? That way that army would not enter. Right? Hmm. I think that's a potentiality. And that's why the city looks so weird, why it has, like, half of it is just water. What if they, like, destroyed and flooded it as a, like last-ditch effort to protect the Erd Tree. Maybe. Maybe. All right. Well, I suppose when next we come back, we did fully explore all out there. Well, you know what? Here, let's look through the gate real quick. We'll just look through the fucking actual gate because I don't think I ever actually just passed right through it. But when next we come back, assuming there's no big weird-ass thing over here, we will check at the other end, right? Yeah, here's the catapults. We destroyed them. We went up and over to those camps and shit. There's some foot soldiers out here. Yep, yep, yep. All this business. Okay. Altus Plateau. Over this way. Anything else over here? No, I think we searched this as well. Right, because we're outside of the wall. I'm pretty sure I came back through here. All right, yeah. So, when next we come back, we'll search everything to the east of this road and to the north of this one, right? Including maybe this water area. There may also be stuff in here. Maybe it goes underneath, right? Maybe there's a subterranean level. Yeah, I have no idea how to actually enter the city. Oh, look, here's a minor herd tree that's kind of sprouted up in a pretty, uh, fair and decent way. Probably have an Erd tree avatar there, I would guess. Hmm. Maybe this is a church. There is this blackguard. I don't know what that means. And why they're already there. Do we know someone named Blackguard? It's like a title. Do we know a blackguard? Maybe we do. Maybe, they're, maybe it's someone we knew before, but they've taken on a different name. Or maybe I've just forgotten. <laughs> okay. Well, when next we come back, we shall go check over here through all this stuff, right? It looks fucking horrible. It looks nasty as shit. The entire ground has been, like, gone through some degree of upheaval, right? Uh, notice as well, this one actually has Guiding Grace, doesn't it? Yeah, it shoots up here. It's like, oh, go this way. Just as well, this one is also like, oh, go up here. And then this one, it leads over here too. Huh. Weird. Strange. And yet this also, the Bridge of Inquiry, apparently it's called. Or, no. Iniquity. Leads over here to the mountain. Which I do also want to check out as well, but I'm not sure, once again, which one we should do first. Okay. Well, when next we come back... We're checking it out. Until next time, please take care of each other. <laughs>